Alright, let's players, welcome back to the Legend of Zelda Second Quest, and I'm your host, Delmasaurus. And we're back in level 2, and we are looking for... Choose the right button here. We are... Oh, I remember when these things were hard to kill. We are looking for a, uh, an elusive key that we missed from before. This dungeon should, this should be pretty easy from what I've faced in later levels. And I think I need to go this way if I understood the directions right. There we go. I don't know how I failed to do that before. I'll never know. Unfortunately, now that I have uh, that key, it's time to move on to Dungeon 6. And, uh, well, with my, my track record on these dungeons, of on new dungeons has been wonderful, but I have no idea where to go. I have only hunches. Jerk. one thing I have not had uh, really uh, I haven't done much exploring on is the uh, I, I don't know what else I really can't remember for the life of me where I was going to go with that I don't know. Let's go and see about getting a potion. Because it sounds like I'm going to really need it. Sure. I'd be left with no money. But I think it'd probably be more beneficial in the long run. And I'm sure everyone else has been uh, yelling at me for um, the last several, several videos will agree that uh, I'm far more better off with the having that potion than I was with the uh... apparently I'm doing wonderfully with the words today because I keep losing my train of thought I really don't think there's anything in these rocks but I think it doesn't hurt to try to push them because okay I swore there is a cave there okay I've I used two bombs I'm on that screen I'm, I'm gonna hold off for now I was, I was aiming for the boomerang to do that. But I, I do have to say, I'm, I have to give myself some credit, because 
I, I really, I, I think I'm getting better. I don't know how well I fully explored this area either. But I really do. I think I'm, uh, I'm getting, I think I'm getting better at the game. And as a testament to that, I have not died in several videos. Though I still can't hit successfully hit Azora. Wow, two fairies on the same screen. Okay. That, that bush just sitting there just... Let me use my boomerang for that. It looked like there should have been something there. That one lone bush. But, you know. I've been told that I'm really bad at not really checking these trees and using my uh, candle like I should, but... I think one reason I'm just really bad at it is that... Uh, I can only use it once per screen, so I'd... I use it once per screen and then I'd, I don't think about it. Alright, now I'm, now I'm starting to get unhappy. Take away my sword. And I've already been there, that was disappointing. But I'm, I'm like really am running out of things to say for this video because I'm I'm looking for places I might have missed that might be a dungeon and really if if anyone has any ideas they give me that they do that to me every time if everyone has any anybody knows or has a hint they want to uh, pass on to me and if I've missed anything blatant that uh, just make sure you let me know in my all my comments because no, last time I played this, I lost 40 rupees. I'm, I'm not doing that again. It's easy to get money if I use save state abuse, but I'm, I'm not resorting to save state abuse. I refuse. That really went more badly than it should have. There it was. Talking about how I'm getting better at this game. And I only got hit way too many times for that. Now I'm here. This is dungeon four, and there's a key here, and there's the key I already knew about in dungeon five that I skipped because I don't have the ladder. 
and I was told that I get the ladder in Dungeon 6. But, of course I stop and swing my sword and I get hit by the rock. But as to where Dungeon 6 is, I'm not sure. I think I need to go check on the other side again. Alright, well, okay, I'm, so I'm back here by where Dungeon 1 is, and I'm at full hearts, and so I'm, I'm going to say that's a good place to stop for today.